here at the Ridley Spot Farm Shop. You know what this means. So we're going into the shop now. <laughs> it's a bit windy. We are in Stowe on the Wold. And look at this super cute entrance. There is there are trees around the entrance of the church. It's St. Edward's Church in Stowe on the Wold. Next to a graveyard. These gravestones are from 1850. Very, very old. Some of them you can't read anymore. I'm feeling like Harry Potter. What a cute church. We have arrived at our hotel. It's called Wild Time and Honey Hotel and it looks like this. So let's have a look. So we are in room 15, the hair. It's very cozy. So here's a little wardrobe. And here is our bathroom. Shower and some bathrobes. It's super cute. Everything is so cute in here. And here is another wardrobe. And we have been upgraded. There's a bathtub in uh, in the room. And here's our bed. Ah, maybe we need a second duvet, okay. And then we have a very beautiful view outside. Can you see the ducks? Ah, there's a boy with two girls. Love the view. Better than last night. Good morning. We are at the breakfast table and we had a semi good night, but to be honest, I'm not sleeping very well outside of my house. And we are alone, so I can show you the room. Now somebody is coming. See you later. Uh, pancakes with bacon and I have a poached egg on avocado bread. Mm. So it's raining today and here is a cozy lounge just for residents only and there was a fire last night and you can sit here very cozy with some blankets and so on. It's pretty nice here. So we are upstairs and I'll show you <coughs> the little river we can see from our window. That's so beautiful. Maybe we can rent some rain shoes or something like this and walk around with our raincoats. Let's see how my husband would like that. No, oh, no. Oh. Yet, uh, I just I don't know what they're doing here, but there are some reindeers. <laughs> they are so cute. I think on the opposite side there's a reindeer farm and they are here today. <sighs> Wasn't able to pet them. So we went to a rainy walk um, before lunchtime. It was yeah quite rainy and we um, were able 
able to rent some wallies. Um, yeah, and now the sun came out. Very nice. And I'm uh, trying to get to the other side of the street um, because there are some horses. But this is a very... Okay, let's go. <coughs> I was able to pass the street. It's a busy street and I'm always struggling um, where to look on which side. So let's see if we can get to the horses. There's a fence again. Look, there's the horse. How can I get to you? Hmm. Look at this sunshine, it's beautiful. So there's a, a long way up there and there is the horse, but there's no way to get to her. Oh, she's already looking at me. Hello, I would like to come to you, but I don't know how. <laughs> she's so cute. Uh, okay, I will look around the corner and if there's nothing I would return back to the hotel. Oh, there's another one! <laughs> look at these. Hmm. I know it's just horses. I know it's just horses but I'm crazy about them. I tried everything now but there are always fences and little walls and fences. Okay, bye bye. Beautiful. Good morning. It's again raining, and we are in a little town called La Coque. And here are some Harry Potter movie spots we are trying to find. So we have reached our first destination and this is the hideaway house from Professor Slughorn where he uh, was hidden when Dumbledore and Harry um, yeah, visited him and asked him to come back to Hogwarts. Here it is. thinking that this is uh, the house of, of the Potters in Godric's Hollow, but we are not sure. Yeah. And there's a very cute church in here. And some people are saying that this is the Potters house. And there is another one. We will check that out. So it might be the house of the Potters where Voldemort came and tried to kill Harry and everybody else. I'm not sure. Maybe it's this one. <laughs> but it's very cute. A very cute street. And it could also be this one. I don't know. But there's a very cute street and houses over here. So, welcome to Bath. This is the... Famous bridge called Pultenay, and there's a funny water action down below. And yeah, it's still raining. <laughs> we are happy about that. Not. And now we're heading to the Abbey. Here is uh, the Abbey from Bath, and um, not far away there should be the Roman Bath. Yeah, behind that. So let's go. This 
is the other side of the Abbey. Oh, Very nice door. And here are the Roman baths. Pump room. It's a restaurant. Very nice. Okay, we've made it. Uh, Gay Street up. So this is Gay Street over there. And we are now in the circus. Circus. It's just called Circus because the Romans like a little bit of circuses and it's uh, yeah it's round <laughs> and there's a little tree center in the middle and there's Gay Street again. We arrived at the Royal Crescent. This is the Royal Crescent. There's a construction. And here is number one on the right hand side. So this was the first building that was built. And then those people could have a wonderful view over a nice park. This is Royal Crescent number one. And we have uh, some Bridget and wives here because this is uh, the house of Lady Dan uh, Featherington. The house of Lady Featherington. We're in a very pink cafe. It's called the Little Sweet Things or something in Bath, and we are getting some sweets. We are leaving now Bath. It was a shower <laughs> from the top. Um, yeah, it was a bit rainy in here um i didn't film anything in the cafe because they forgot us and we sat there i don't know half an hour or something like this um to get a coffee a hot chocolate and two cake slices of cake and now we are trying to leave bath but it's very uh, crowded the traffic is bad we are heading now into the direction of exeter where our next hotel is. We have arrived in Exeter. We are at the courtyard by Marriott Hotel in Sandy Park. And yeah, this is a standard room. Just a bed and television. And here is a coffee machine and so on. And we are not in Exeter, so we are outside. Nothing to see here. And um, here is a mystery door. And in here is uh, the bathroom. It looks basic and clean. Nothing else we need for one night. We've been to KFC tonight and after that we went to a super store, a Tesco Extra. Yeah, but only found some sweets, left them in the car, and yeah, now we are chilling, and hopefully the weather is better tomorrow. There's the wonderful sunshine over there. We are in the breakfast room, and we are heading to the south. Station. We are in Dartmoor now, and yeah, it looks really nice here. And there are a lot of sheep. Can you see them? Over there. Hmm? 
These are wild horses in that war. That was famous for one. The bird just landed. So we went up a little hill. Still in dark. We have reached the top of the hill and here are some stone graves. I'm not sure if it's called like that. But yeah. Let's look behind it. We arrived in Whitman's Wood. With stones. All those stones with moss and trees with moss. It's so beautiful. Those moss trees. Look how it flies in the wind. We have arrived in Porth Beach. Um, it's near New Quay, and yeah, we uh, we are in the Porth Beach Hotel, and we have the garden view, room number six. And we enter, and then there's um, already the bathroom with a nice bath, tap, tub, with a shower and a bathtub toilet and here is the room and it looks very nice so here's the sofa and here's the bed and here's another sitting possibility and yeah, here's the wardrobe and let's see if we have garden view yes we have so it was a really rainy drive until here and we wanted to see more from Bodmin Moors and some stone circles but it was just a heavy rain and yeah it didn't make sense so we are here now and hopefully the weather is getting better now. The rain has stopped and I can show you a very nice view from here. I don't want to be in the waves today. Okay, yeah, but um, we will go over there. We just had an early dinner um, at Pizza Express. <laughs> uh, all the other restaurants weren't open yet and we were hungry, so we decided to go there.
We are having our swimsuits with us, but uh, my husband isn't very keen to go into the water. <laughs> and to be honest, me neither. Mm -hmm. 